Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Creative Mind. Well, actually, this is not an episode of Creative Mind, and I know that I said I should do Creative Mind, uh, and I also done Creative Mind. Uh, I've done two episodes, but the first one was an issue with um, the the sound and like yeah the overall quality of the recording. It has taken me a while to get this uh, figured out and hopefully it sounds good and looks good now so i hope you dig this um and the second one uh was part of a competition uh with uh, arturia so um that can't be released uh until after march 15. so yeah so this should be the first episode uh but it won't be this will be a video where I show you how to get this shit working. Using a microphone, using your door. Uh, I work with Studio One, as you can see. Uh, and I use uh, OBS to record this. So yeah, this is a picture in picture in picture. We want to record uh, in Studio One, we want to have the audio from this mic going to studio one so uh, we also want to have uh, the music or the project um, opened in studio one so let's try that out okay so we loaded up a project in studio one and like uh, now it's uh, the settings for when I create beats and I uh, record so if we listen to it now you'll probably hear nothing right and so now in the background we have studio one playing and we only have my mic sound we have this uh it says skribordsjud which is excellent swedish for desktop sound so nothing sounds here now yeah but this is playing so it should sound should be sounds everywhere so i use this vst plugin like it's an effect voxango recorder uh, and just put that you might get a bit of delay and uh, also if you have a lot of processing going on you um, you will always put this one in, in the last of the chain to get it correct and then you'll get up this little uh, picture and you want to send your uh, studio one sound card your ACU sound card to another route I always push this as high as I can go and the buffer size as low as I can go to get the, um, the least amount of delay output to MME which creates like a MME device Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, it's uh, NVIDIA one. I think I choose, right? Let's try and press, press play here. The sound in Studio One, as we can see here. Let's check OBS. Nothing. But we also have to select that card. And we choose the NVIDIA. Yeah, so there we go. 